Up next here on The Morning Show, uh, there were five up-and-coming singers until TV turned them into megastars. Well, now two former members of Bardo are back and teaming up all over again. Katie Underwood and Belinda Chappell join us live next up. Well, it was a wild time back in the year 2000. Uh, we'd survived the millennium bug. Everyone was <laughs> yelling out, not happy, Jan. Happy Jan. And the country prepared for what would become one of the best Olympic Games ever. The turn of the century also brought another pop culture moment, a little TV show called Pop Stars. And while singing shows are all the rage now, back then it was a relatively new format and it also produced one of the top pop songs of the decade. While Bardo may not have stood the test of time, a lot of the ladies have remained friends and two of them have even started their own group called Cabell. Well, Katie Underwood and Belinda Chappell join us live. Hello. Hi. We love seeing that footage. Do you love seeing that footage? Mm. I love the film clip. <laughs> yeah, the film clip. That clips. first film clip was... But the actual yeah. show footage, Belinda, you were like, oh, I don't know. Well, it is 20 years ago, so... What do you well, 22. 22. 22 years 20 ago. Years. <laughs> 22. Wow. How, often, how often do you think back on those days? Are they all fond memories? Uh, really fond for me, mainly. Yeah. It was an incredible experience. I mean, we, we went through something totally unique together, I think, that no one, has, no one that I will ever know has ever gone through. And even because we've had so many reality TV shows, having been the very first, it was so amazingly special to be involved in that. Yeah. Do you keep an eye on reality TV shows now? Are you watching other music reality TV shows and go, ah, we wouldn't have done it that way? I don't, mm. I don't tend to watch no, them. I, I think don't because either. I know what goes on behind the scenes. Mm. Um, and it's a bit like when you know too much, it's hard to watch it uh, objectively. Like when you work in a burger chain. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I totally think so. You is. stop eating burgers, right? So <laughs> it's a little bit like that. Exactly right. OK. So the 20th anniversary of the group saw most of you come back together and start hanging out again. COVID then got in the way, right? Uh, any plans on bringing Bardo back, maybe for the 25th anniversary? Just a couple I of years away? Yeah, never say never. We tried very hard. Yeah. <laughs> um, but I think the reality is, you know, 20 years or 22 years have passed. and. Mm. and and other members of the group, like ourselves, have moved on, have businesses and families and other commitments. And the logistics around bringing us all back together would be really tough. But yeah. as Blender said, who knows? 25 just, years, we'll see what happens. We're enjoying doing music together at the moment. Oh, so. yeah, let's talk about yeah. that. Uh, two of you have come together. This is called Carbell. Very clever fusion of both your names. <laughs> it's like when Kyle and I did that song on Larky. It works well. <laughs> so Katie and Belinda, obviously. Yes. Carbell. Thank yeah, you. I was, I was yeah, no, no, it's... For the it's people at home <laughs> who are playing along. Um, how do you decide what sort of music you do in here? I... <laughs> You go. <laughs> Look, Belinda was always our disco queen back in Bido days. Yes. And I obviously have a long passion and relationship with dance music. So it was always going to be pop, pop disco dance, dance, fun, positive. Yeah. yeah, just what we need at the moment. Yeah. And this the world needs. The whole project is really about giving our old Bido fans and new Bido fans what they want, which is light-hearted, happy, fun, uplifting music. Good on you. So that's our directive. Yeah. <laughs> and the two of you, do you two ever sing any Bido songs, just the two of you together? All the time. No. <laughs> we actually don't. Do we, darling? No. No. No, we don't. But we might just swing out a bit of a poison here now and then. I'm maybe. sure we will in yeah. the future. <laughs> in the near future, we will. So, what's the, tell us about the song, your, your new song. Uh, so, Heartstrings is yeah. the second of our two songs, and we've got to work with an incredible producer in LA. Dylan, Dylan Bowles. Fantastic. Yeah. goes yeah. by the name St. N. So, it's been a really amazing process, but um, as you mentioned briefly off there, with mm. COVID, uh, it's been really hard to actually get in the same room together. So, yeah. I think it's a testament to all the people we've worked with that we've been able to record all our vocals separately, have them yeah, produced, and amazing. yet um, come up with this uh, amazing product. So, some really funky creations came out of COVID, yeah. actually. Yeah. Some great right. products from around the world. COVID, yeah, made us do some crazy things. You're right. Like, what we're doing like now. Like we are, yeah. 22 <laughs> years later, decided to do music again. Yeah. So, yeah. Hey, Belinda, tell us about the TV show that you're involved with. Yeah, 
it's um, paper, it's called Paper Dolls. Um, yeah. It's going to be on Channel 10 next year. And um, it's... I would never have asked if I knew. That. <laughs> <laughs> on a rival network. Uh, yeah, right. yeah. Okay. It's uh, fictional, inspired by true events. Okay. Oh, yeah. By very true events. Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely to see you guys. It sounds fun. Thank you so much for coming in. Thanks for Thank having you. Us. Thanks for having us. Carl Bell's newest single, it's called Heartstrings. It's what it looks like. It's available to stream or download right now. Thank you, Katie. Thank you, Belinda. Good seeing you. Thanks, Thank guys. You.